Here comes a cheap new iPhone, maybe. Yahoo Finance tech editor Dan Halley is here uh, with more on this, Dan. That's right, Brian. We have uh, an announcement from Apple that they're going to be hosting an event uh, later next week, March 8th. Uh, this is going to be a virtual event similar to what we've seen from Apple in the past uh, because of COVID, obviously. So uh, it'll be live streamed on YouTube, likely Apple's website if you have the Safari browser. Uh, and uh, you know, this is going to be an event where we'll end up seeing perhaps uh, that new low-cost iPhone you were talking about, a new iPhone SE. This is expected to get upgrades over the prior SE uh, with 5G being the biggest upgrade. That's the wireless technology, obviously, as well as camera improvements uh, and perhaps a more powerful chip. And I mean, you know, the SE is pretty long in the tooth at this point. So these are welcome upgrades. Uh, and the fact that it would be a low cost iPhone with 5G is really impressive and it could help drive 5G adoption even higher. And the other devices that we're expecting from this event are perhaps a new iPad Air. The last time that was updated was in 2020. Uh, that will also get 5G as well as uh, a new processor and then perhaps a new Mac. We're not sure exactly what it could be. It could be a desktop, uh, more likely a desktop than anything else. And those are really the big updates that we're expecting. Now, this is going to be a year where Apple ro ro rolls out a ton of new products. We're expecting to hear from them about a new AR VR headset, as well as obviously the new iPhone at the end of the year, that would perhaps be the iPhone 14 or whatever they want to call it at that point. Uh, and there's also supposed to be a handful of new Apple watches and on top of that, some new Macs with Apple's M2 processor, that's their in-house chip and the upgrade to the M1. So a huge year for Apple coming up. And these are just the first three devices that we're expecting to see. Look, I just want a new AirPods Pro second gen. That's that's all I want. Well, we hope you get your wish, <laughs> Dan Holly. Thanks so much. Uh, looking forward to that event and more news from Apple. We're